documentary with Ice T, and could anyone with his, other than him, with his credentials, have, have pulled this off? Well, uh, no, uh, nobody, nobody but Ice T could pull it off. And, and actually, I, you know, I, I was just doing it as a favor. You know, Ice is a good guy, and he's always, you know, been fair, and, and you know, and, and I like him he's a, as, as a person and and as a as an artist. So I really didn't actually want to do the movie, but I mean, if you wanted me to do, you always help out a friend, and I, I, it came out really good. I tried not to like the movie, of course, because I'm a hater, but it turned out a lot better than what I thought, and that's what I told like. So after I seen the movie, it definitely turned out a lot better than what I thought it would be. Does it amaze you how far hip hop's come when you consider its roots, how, how mainstream it's become in many ways? Yeah, I mean, well, I, I never I never really was one that thought that hip hop would go past what we was doing, but so, uh, I mean, but being that it's a blessing, a lot of other guys uh, from us got blessed, but uh, it's not amazing as far as how far it came. I think it's more amazing to me about how far that it, it slipped from what we was doing compared to what's going on right now. What, what for you are the key ingredients to being a successful hip hop artist, and how did you first get involved? Well, it, to be to be successful as far as hip hop, as far as I'm concerned, you have to always try to uh, bring out the difference in it. And, and, you know, you never went on on the same. But that would work opposite for guys now. That they they success is based on the last guy that was hot. Our, our whole thing was based on us being different. We was like guys from the Bronx, and we tried to be rock stars. We was like trying to be Billy Idol. With and, and the straight cats, and, 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 that's, and that's how our portion of hip hop was formed, just trying to be the, be the different and not the same. I suppose you touch on this, I mean, I know it means different things to different people, but what does it mean to you, and um, why do you love this art form so much? Well, uh, hip hop for me, I mean, it, it, it's everything. It, it, it's the one thing that uh, made the difference, uh, you know, in, in where I grew up, and in, 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 in how, I, how I thought about things, and the type of different people that I, I ran into throughout my career, you know, just going to different places, tasting different foods. It was just, you know, it, it just meant so much, not only to me, but even to everybody that I grew up around, because it, that, that was the only thing that set us apart from everything else that was going on, is that, you know, we was doing hip hop when everybody else was doing disco and funk, and then, and then and hip hop just, you know, would be a great thing. And then even all the people that I grew up with, and was a part of it, they are, they are so proud that they were the ones that were there, and that we were the ones that did it, so it meant everything. Thanks so much for your time, real pleasure to meet you.